the Indians who are back home finally heaving a sigh of relief because they've returned to the country uh, escaping from the war ravaged Israel. As 212 Indian nationals returned home, the Indian government has also assured that the rest stranded Indians will also be brought back in a similar way and that the embassy in, is in touch with every Indian back in Israel. Our external affairs minister, he announced uh, Operation Ache, uh, which is to help our fellow Indian citizens uh, to travel to India, to return to India, those who wish to return to India. How many more flights we can expect in the coming days? It's an evolving situation, uh, so uh, we'll try and see, uh, we will try and have uh, similar flights in the, in the subsequent days and we'll be informing our uh, citizens who've registered with us uh, uh, shortly. Joined by Mr. T.B. Chandra, who is the Delhi special representative from Karnataka government, and he has specially come to receive the students who is from Karnataka and who have returned from Israel. Uh, sir, what was the process, and uh, how did you manage to bring all those passengers back with collaboration with Indian government? We were we were not knowing anything much about it, hmm. and uh, this operation Vijay has started uh, bringing uh, people from the Israel. Uh, to the motherland. So uh, after hearing all these things, I have come here from Bangalore to receive them. And uh, it is a happy moment that uh, many people have come and landed and still more to come. Uh, how and many from Karnataka have come today? About five people have come in this first flight. Uh, uh, how many will come in the next flight, we don't know. What they said, about more than 18,000 uh, Indians are there in Israel and more than four to 5,000 are from Karnataka. And we were knowing and the Karnataka government is aware that many people from Karnataka, uh, they are in uh, Israel and we are, we are taking care uh, to see that they all reach their uh, places. Vijay Chandraji, what's next in the pipeline? What are your plans to bring those students also back now, those people uh, still who are stuck there? No, the embassy is, is in constant touch with them. The embassy has given uh, the information for all the Indians, whoever wants to come to India, they, they, they can come on their own. On their own means government has taken all care. So they are coming in big number. Are you still in touch with those who are stuck there and yeah, how are you yeah. coordinating no, with the families? No, no, the, uh, uh, there is no actually, there is no direct communication. What we hear from the who have landed here.